Hey guys, welcome back to another mod review on this channel. Today I'm going to show you the simple planes mod for Minecraft version 1.19. This mod adds small planes and helicopters you can fly and customize to your Minecraft world. So let's get started. To get going we first need a plane workbench. The workbench is used to create planes and helicopters. There are three vehicles, a small plane which can only fit one passenger but needs the least amount of fuel. It can be crafted in the plane workbench using a propeller and five oak planks. A large plane which can fit two passengers but needs more fuel than a smaller version. It can be crafted using a propeller and ten oak planks. Then there is a helicopter which can fit two passengers or a large upgrade instead of a second passenger. It can be crafted using two propellers and seven oak planks. You can use different types of wood to change the color of your aircraft. Aircrafts can get damaged. If you enter an aircraft, there is a health bar on the right. If the aircraft is damaged, the health will regenerate over time while you are sitting down on it and the aircraft is parked. You can also use the quick fix kit to repair it immediately. To power your aircraft you need an engine. You can use a furnace engine or an electric engine. Apply the engine of your choice simply by right clicking. The furnace engine is powered by furnace fuel like coal. You can put fuel in the engine by opening the aircraft's interface while sitting in it. You are able to open the interface by pressing X but you can switch the key in the controls. If you use the electric engine you can charge it by using the charging station. The charging station can charge the aircraft when it is put below the aircraft. The station itself needs forge energy to work. In order to obtain forge energy you need additional mods. For example you can use the mechanism mod. You can check the amount of energy in your electric engine in the plane interface by pressing X. So now that our plane is ready to start, how can we fly it? You can accelerate and ascend by pressing W. And you decelerate and descend by pressing S. If you start flying and keep pressing W, your plane will keep turning upwards until it can't fly properly anymore. But if you stop pressing W completely, it will stop flying as well. So press space while flying to keep a constant angle and speed. You can change the key for that in the config. Of course, you are still able to adjust the angle while pressing space. If you are flying a helicopter, you can ascend by pressing space and move forward and slightly ascend by pressing W. You can descend by pressing S. You are also able to upgrade your aircraft. To add the upgrade, right click while looking at the plane and holding the upgrade in your hand. You can add armor to your aircraft. You can add chests, which can be accessed by opening your inventory while sitting in the aircraft. You are able to add a floaty bedding to make your aircraft float on water. A folding upgrade, which makes the aircraft return to your inventory upon dismounting it. A supply crate, which can be filled like a chest and then be dropped by using the C key. The key can be changed in the controls. You can also add a rocket booster, which you are able to activate by right clicking with gunpowder in your hand while sitting in the aircraft. You are also able to add more seats to provide more room for passengers. And you can add a dispenser. If the dispenser is added, just right click with fireworks, fire charges or arrows while sitting in the aircraft to shoot them. To remove the upgrades, right click the aircraft with a wrench. Also, supply crates, chests and dispensers can only be added to large planes and helicopters. You can put any banner on an aircraft as a decoration. If you are using a large plane or helicopter, you can place TNT in the aircraft and use a flint and steel to drop the TNT while flying. Furthermore, you can craft a parachute, which you can use by right-clicking while in the air. If you forget anything about how to use this mod, or you want to look up stuff while playing, you can install the patchouli mod, with which you can receive a book in-game, which contains all explanations regarding the mod. This is it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you don't want to miss any further reviews, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next time.